What's up, y'all? Got a film of the feast, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into Corey exposed the real reason Carmen want, won't divorce him. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie, I already reacted to, to all that. I'm gonna have a video for it, uh, but we're gonna get to the... Did respond the to Corey stating that she's going to jail. She posted on Instagram, Corey, your attorney stated that you asked for a cease and desist letter, which is only $200 to $500. You haven't even paid him for a case. And he clearly stated that he didn't want any parts of what you're doing after my attorney showed him evidence. And mm. I'll go to hell once you prove to all of us those transactions are recent you're miserable broke delusional stop speaking on me now Dang. she's speaking on when Corey is that he has money and he's been spending I money i haven't been even <clears throat> speaking on this dude once i spoke on this up one two three days i was done with it i have moved on like when I did danny go live I have moved on leave me alone like i'm trying to get settled in my new penthouse in atlanta I gotta go get settled in my in my condo in Dallas, and I still gotta check on my mansion in Houston. I'm back to the things I used to do before I even met him. Like I used to be in Atlanta every weekend, every weekend, like doing different stuff, filming and everything. So leave me alone. Don't mention my name to try to run your views up. Like, and at the end of the day, even if y'all run his views up, he wasn't making no money. I don't know. YouTube. He was making like fourteen hundred dollars one week. The next week, he probably get like two thousand dollars. It's here and there. It ain't the money that he used to make the thirty thousand dollars, a hundred thousand a month. He is not getting it no more. I'm just letting y'all know because if he was getting it, he would have his own cars. Like, so take that into consideration. If he was getting it, he would have his own house. He won't be staying from house to house. Yeah, we know Corey ain't got no money right now. Um, and doing none of that weird, fugazi, broke ass. Shit. So I'm just gonna be honest. Like, a lot of y'all on this live got way more money, way more emotion than that man. Like, just look at the way he moved. Like, damn, you, she said a lot of people on the live got more. Move like a bitch. Damn. Like, stop mentioning people's names to keep yourself relevant. And I'm not, I'm not saying you mentioning my name to keep yourself relevant, but you mentioning other people's names to keep yourself relevant. That's not cool. That's a big move. That's, that, that's stuff that do. That's how I know you get. <laughs> I know you get. <laughs> hey, Scream. So, yo, leave me alone. I'm not getting in the camera because I haven't put my clothes on for tonight and I'm still like I'm still in my robe so I'm not getting in, I'm not getting in the camera really but my hair is cute though yes posting old pictures just doing anything to stay relevant posting old videos is crazy I ain't even gonna get up but here's my thing if you do stay relevant on the internet what money are you making by being relevant? So we can, they can keep you, they can keep posting you on Shade Room. They can keep doing these, doing these, doing these. But what are you getting out of that if you don't got nothing to sell or nothing to offer? You're still not making no money. It's not like you getting paid off um, YouTube because you ain't dropping no vlogs. YouTube is going live, something that you're not getting paid for versus doing <clears throat> what really got you. Which is crazy the bag and that's dropping blogs so he missing the whole narrative that just lets you know how dumb he is like if you stay off live and go back to vlogging you can run your bag back up nigga you be on live like a you be on live every day every day just talking for free every day just like people get tired of hearing that shit. I swear, like, every time something good happened for somebody that he don't like, his ass going live. He going live. He bringing up the same situations. He, bring, I'm, I'm ready to get the paper signed. I miss this. I miss that. Like, we tired of this shit. Like, you, like, come on now. Dude, move on. Get you somebody. Be happy. Like, hopefully they can take care of you. You take care of them. And just leave people alone.
on. It's simple. Literally. Yes, that's why he has to go back and upload old videos. He wants y'all to go view them so he can try to get paid some off his youth. Now you guys leave your opinions <clears throat> on this down in the comment section below. At this point, all of this is just one big mess. Let me my mom. Yeah, bro. You can understand. See how the next me for too long. I was quiet, but now it's like I'm back. I'm gonna pop my shit. You don't like it, get the phone. Buddha. They think I am, I swear to God, I don't. But don't never let a quiet fool you think that he ain't who he is and he don't know who he is. Y'all got me up, so now I'm back, pop my shit. I swear to God, watch the seat. I ain't gonna lie. It's nothing wrong with being confident because that's what you're supposed to do, but. Yeah, that boy is just not that. <laughs> he, somebody got to tell him what to do. He gives me, he been giving me that real bad. Like, tell me how to do it. Tell me how to fix it. And then he go do it and blow it. Just... Um, let's get into. I need three more minutes, so let's get Ciara and Jordan. The other day I reported that Ciara had posted a video where she was frustrated because Jordan wasn't really helping her out as much as she would like. Now guys, we did not know if she had made that very clear to Jordan that she needed more help since they just went months without talking. And even if she didn't, he should just be wanting to help out a lot more just because he is the parent as well. Now, Ciara did drop a video oh, yesterday shit. where she was- Let me drop in two videos a night, y'all. If y'all ain't tapped into the Patreon ski, I don't know what to tell you. Going off about <coughs> Infinity, answering a question, speaking oh, about her and Jordan's co-parenting. Infinity- Yeah, this year, this was strike one. Strike one was when me and Jordan were going into it. I don't know what we were going into it for, but I have the screenshot of when he came DMing me talking about how with this op ass nigga and how he knew this day would come and I'm such an op, da 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 da. Come to find out, Infinity is the one who told him that I was with, I guess, her ex. I don't know. But first of all, I would never want to anything after you. We're going to start there and we're going to leave it there. That was my strike one because why are you running back telling Jordan anything <laughs> like Y'all, where is it at? It ain't there yet. Zeus be late because it's definitely late. It's giving late right now. All right, y'all. We done with this video. I done got some. Ooh, don't mind. Damn. <clears throat> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Oh, I still got 10 seconds. <laughs> I've never struggled this hard to get eight minutes. Come on. Okay, bye. <laughs>